welcome back. This is Bella Scooby with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. I'm joined, as always, by my upgraded squad of Radio Kane, Rosa, Cecil, and Edge. As you can see, I've been doing a little bit of level grinding, like I said I would. I primarily wanted to get Edge up to level 29. Hopefully, he can get to level 30 uh, by, uh, by the next boss fight. That is really what I'm looking for. As you can see, I've actually moved him to the back row. Why did I do this? He is a melee fighter because I gave him a boomerang. And as long as you get one hand, keep one hand on the boomerang, and, and he attacks with that, then he can do just as much damage from the back row. As you saw, or as you're going to see now, he actually has the least amount of HP outside of Rydia. Even Rosa has more HP than him. So he really can't take a punch. I mean, look at Cecil's defense of 50, as opposed to Edge's defense of 33. It's just not even close. He can't really take a punch. So, he's in the back row, with all the other people who can't take a punch. So, we need to move up and go the way that the game had originally intended us to go. And once we get into a fight that I'm willing to show off, I can show off some of Edge's capabilities. But we've made it to the Tower of Babil once again! Uh, there seem, doesn't seem to be a way inside. How are we gonna get in? Watch! Here we go! And he busts right on through the door! No, he's not going to stay in front of my party. And over here we get a Q3. Are there going to be new enemies? There are. So, we have a few new techniques we can show off. One of which is uh, Ninja. He has Flame, which attacks all enemies with basically Fire 2, Fire 3 level. And then he has Pin, uh, which only damages one enemy. He can Sneak, which is the same as Steal, uh, but if you fail, that it, it, it hurts you. And then he has Dart, where he can throw things. Uh, he's just going to be attacking right now because I've wasted enough time and everybody's getting destroyed. Virus, no! Doesn't poison, sweet. And uh, let's start uh, killing everybody. Oh, no, he was poisoned. It doesn't show that he was on screen, though. Well, it just, yeah, slowly his health is fading away. Let's go for fire, too. Go cure to heal everybody. Actually, need to do that for more if I could. Just fight again. Uh, dart. I'm hardly ever going to be using. I might never use that until the end of the game. To be honest with you. Oh, and the sorcerer uses uses wall. Really, the blade man is. Oh, I hate you sometimes, blade man. Is that like a counterattack? What the hell? Because you are doing a shit ton of damage. Down he finally goes. Down he finally goes. Cure 2 all around. Helps a little bit. Then, uh, can... Oh, you... Dick. Okay, so a green dragon has shown up, and... Really? Really? Okay, we're going to be using some ninja skills. Here we go, flame! Oh, this is not working out well for me at all. Jump on the green dragon. Uh, still not enough for the victory on the sorcerer. This is not good. This does not spell oh, good news for anybody. Uh, God. Heal yourself, pig. Pig, heal thyself. We still can't use black magic on uh, on the sorcerer, I don't think, so I'm just going to keep attacking uh, the green dragon with some of my spells. Green dragon is usually end game level, but I do not believe that this dragon is near the end game level at all. If you could cure him, yeah, that'd be greatly appreciated. Go another fire, down goes the green dragon, so no, definitely not end game level. With 1,075 gil, 2,474 experience. That's quite a lot of experience. So let's keep going. Doesn't seem to be a way, apparently, to that chest. And we have balloons. I don't think we've seen balloons before. 
before. <laughs> I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. Luckily, virus did go away. I am going to need to heal some more, though. Unfortunately. Cure 2's all around! Cure 2 for everybody! This is not going well so for me so far back in the Tower of Babel. Um, yeah, just do Fire 2. We'll see how that works for everybody. Go Drain Spear! Heal yourself with it! Or just miss. That's exactly what I wanted as well. Either way. Either way. Down they go! They do not go, but... Hopefully, once Cecil gets his turn, we should be able to finish this off. Down it goes, therefore this turn is wasted. Alright, we get 1260 gil, 1984 experience. Nice, a lot of experience. And yes, I will take the cure ones. I will need them. So let's keep heading to the left, since there's no way to that chest just yet. We'll have to work our way back around to get there. Are there more new enemies? Another egg. So first things first, uh, let, let's let everybody back into their proper rows if we could. I don't think it really matters who goes first. Attack! The, the, what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Ah, damn it, it's another Lamia. Alright, let's move on, see if we can find a way to get that treasure chest. And as a result of that battle, Rosa did level up, it learned Wall, so I can start casting Reflect on, on my party members, should I want to. Let's head over here, finally we've get, gotten the treasure chest, we get a Cure 3 out of there, and new enemies. We'll see, we'll see, because uh, the, 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 the egg randomly spawns some kind of new enemy, we'll see what it is, we'll see, no. Why, game, why? Why don't you give me new enemies to show off? Instead, we will head up here to the basement second floor, apparently. To another egg. I might just start cutting these out until you spawn something else. Because this is starting to get ridiculous. Seriously. Why don't you give me a new enemy to show off? I want to show off you, game. Why won't you let me this fight again? Let's continue on, going around the outside, around the outside, to the middle, apparently, of the, the tower. No, I'm cutting you out. So let's head down here, and down here we can find another treasure chest with monsters inside. Oh, crap. Okay, uh, I think I do have a new, st a, a new strategy for these guys. I'm going to cast size on all of them, and I believe this works. I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. Uh, if not, let's let's try to change them as well to, to pigs. Uh, you still have the, the, the chain rod on. Okay, apparently the chain rod does not work. Let's jump! Come on, size! Size does work, and I've mini them all! There we go! That's the strategy. That's the strategy. I knew there was some gimmick to these things. Just smack them upside the head. Why don't you, ready? Right That'll work out well for everybody, and then uh, you can start curing around. And uh, we should we should be pretty good now. Now that these guys don't pose any kind of threat to us anymore. That is that is one of the good things about the ma the, the mad ogres is they're susceptible to to some actually. Holy crap, that's a lot of damage. They're susceptible to a, to a spell that you might not imagine them to be susceptible to. They're so big, well, reduce their size. That shouldn't work, but it does. It does so well. So let's just finish this off. I, I want to keep this in because it's technically required, and it's been a while since we've seen Mad Ogres. They might actually be an upgrade uh, based off of Ogres that we've seen before. And down they finally go. You get 10... Well, 1,000, 1,080 gil, and 1,896 experience. Edge gains a level. He's made it up to level 30, and we've gotten the Ogre Axe for our trouble. Uh, let's take a look at that. I, wait, what am I doing? He can't equip it, can he? He can. Should he desires, he can lower his defense, but... Or raise his defense, lower his offense by a ton, so that's not going to happen. What about Edge? 
can he equip that? No, he can't equip axes. And then, uh, Cecil would be the only other one. Probably not better than the Ice Brand. God, he's got a lot of stuff. Oh, it is! It is better. So, okay, we're gonna be putting, uh, the Ogre on. He's gonna be using an axe, and my axe no longer requires the sword. But we're not gonna be able to do the ice elemental damage for now. I might change that. Doesn't look like there's anywhere else for us to go, so let's head up to the third floor. Is this gonna be a save room or a chest room? This is the way further on? No, 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 no. How dare you move me forward when I don't want to yet. Uh, okay, I don't think we've seen the... The... Whatever that thing is in the back. The grudger before, so... Let's go ahead and... Uh, try using all our crowd control stuff. All our... All our abilities that could change them into to minis or, or pig them. Whatever. Ah! Worked on the grudger, so... She can no longer cast magic. She still does a decent amount of damage as a pig in terms of physical attacks, but... Go size! Take out the, the mad ogre. Oh, you're mini and a pig, Grudja. How does that feel? It can't feel good. It just can't. Just smack things with a rod in the face. That's how I met my girlfriend. What? Let's keep fighting, though. Uh, that is still not enough to take out the mad... Holy crap, that drain, man, that drain. That does a ton of damage. That's more than enough to heal Kane fully, even if he's... Holy crap, look at that damage. Damn, we're doing a lot of damage. You get 1,050 gil, 1,958 experience. Now we can finally open up this chest to get 2,000 gold. Now, for this part, you might... If there's secret passages here, you need edge in the front of your party. But it doesn't look like there is a spot here, so let's switch it back to Cecil. There we go. Passed by him once, that's okay. Uh, we need to... Let's try left first. Now we're on the fourth floor. Actually, I was wrong. Let's head to the right first. This is the way that I wanted to go. I got thrown off by a treasure chest. Ah, no egg, no! But if we head over here, like I should have done the first time, we can walk around for a while. Hooray. And this is really one step, one step for the same fight, like I was saying. As you can see, this does lead us to the treasure chest that we were looking for. The other way's a dead end. So let's head down here and grab ourselves the middle sword. I think that was a sword. That looks like a short sword, though. Um, so I believe that is for a very go. Short middle! <laughs> it does more damage, as you might expect, because it's longer. I don't, I, I, I don't always understand, but I will, I will go along with it. All right, let's head forward here, and we can get into another fight. Let's head up here. See, as I told you, it's a dead end. Don't go left. All right, from here, I believe we need to head right, just over into. Uh oh. Uh oh. That looks like it's a warp. I don't want to go in there just yet. Let's uh, go in here first instead. This leads us to a save point, which I will be using 